Hello friends, welcome back to the channel. If you are facing network cable unplugged issue on your Windows 10, in this video I will show you how to fix this issue. So let's start with our first step. Click on your Windows icon and type CMD. Now right click on command prompt, then click on run as administrator. Now you will see this black window. Now you have to type a few commands. So the first command is ipconfig space slash flush dns press enter successfully flushed then type the next command netsh space winshock space reset press enter that's it now type exit press enter and after that restart your system and check if you are still getting the same issue now move on to our next step Click on your windows icon and type view network connection. Click on this option view network connections. Now here you will see Ethernet option. Right click on it then click on properties. Now click on this option QoS packet scheduler. Select this option then click on configure. Then click on yes. Now you will see this window. Click on advanced. Now on the left side click on speed and duplex. Now on the right side you will see this value option. Drag down and select this option 100 Mbps half duplex. Select this option. Click on OK. And after that restart your system and check. If you are still getting the same issue change the value 10 Mbps full duplex. Click on OK and after that restart your system and check. If you are still getting the same issue, now move on to our final method. Again open this window, right click on your Ethernet option, then click on properties. Now select this option, Internet Protocol version 4, select this option, then click on configure, click on yes. Now you will see this window, click on the third tab, driver. Now you will see this option rollback driver. This is your first step. In my laptop this option is not available but if this option is available in your laptop try to use this option. So this option will roll back your previous driver and it will fix your issue as well. Now move on to our next step if you are still getting the same issue. Click on this option update driver. Now click on this option browse my computer for drivers. Click on this option let me pick from the list. Now you have two options two drivers go for the latest one then click on next. This will install your LAN driver and if you are still getting the same issue move on to our final step. Click on this uninstall device option click on uninstall. After that restart your system restart your laptop and it will fix your issue. So these are the three powerful methods you can apply to fix this issue. This is all for the video. Thank you.